Hi guys, uh, welcome back to another episode of uh, Linux uh, command line scripting. So far uh, I have discussed about uh, the significance of learning command line scripting uh, with various uh, demos and then I have discussed about the cut command. And in this episode I am going to discuss about uh, sort and uh, unique commands. You know these are something uh, quite frequently you may use, you may use uh, you know both of them together in certain circumstances and uh, as well as sometimes instead of using a unique command you can use uh, you know sort alone and then uh, you can get the desired output as well. So let me just uh, discuss the relevance of learning these two commands uh, and as well as uh, let me show you an example uh, uh, live in my uh, desktop as well. so in a way if you see the sort command uh, is uh, quite handy in a case like if you are getting some sort of command dump and you need to sort the lines and uh, sometimes it can be just alphabetical names or something preceded with numbers or something like that and uh, with a sort command you can sort it down alphabetically or uh, you know as well as uh, you know uh, uh, anything which is started with uh, numbers as well. so so that way sort will be quite useful in case if you are uh, doing a database uh, filter uh, of a csv file or something like that uh, using a sort command in case if you are getting age or something of you know of employees or something using a sort command you can just uh, you know sort those uh, fields as well as uh, you know employee names or something like that so other than that uh, the main advantage of sort is uh, you can also eliminate uh, duplicates and this is almost uh, quite uh, similar to the way you do uh, eliminating of uh, duplicates in a you know using an sql uh, command almost as well. so using the option like once you are done with your uh, you know full command line script you can just follow by with sort so just followed after that you can use the sort and it will sort your you know entries which is supposed to come through you know your command line uh, command as well. so Apart from that, in case you want to eliminate any duplicates using sort, you can just uh, use uh, you know minus u option. So this uh, tells uh, you know uh, this option is quite handy in case you want to eliminate any duplicates and makes you know unique uh, uh, entries as the output of sort command. Apart from that, in case uh, you have any uh, command output uh, which contains like multiple entries, uh, you know. Sub uh, subsequent uh, multiple entries of uh, you know duplicate entries you can use unique option as a unique command so in that case uh, suppose if this is your entire command line script and you can just uh, followed after that you can use unique and uh, with this what happens is uh, if you have any uh, entries uh, of a file or something you can just do say cat abc dot txt and you can apply all your command line uh, script filters and after that followed by which you can just uh, do is in case if this is returning age of people or you know something like that say something like this 22 22 55 35 and something like this and in this case you want to find some sort of age range or something like that and uh, in that case what you can do is you can use the unique option so in case if there are uh, you know two entries coming right after each other you know subsequently after one entry you can use the unique option unique so what happens is it will just check any kind of you know repeating pattern this way and then it is going to give you the you know unique entries as such it is going to remove the duplicates and uh, it is going to uh, you know return you the unique entries but uh, it doesn't uh, work in this way in case you know your output is uh, jumbled and it is not sorted as such. So in case if the output is uh, returning something like 22 and then 55 and then followed by 22 and then 35 using a unique is not going to help you. It is uh, going to stay the same as it is. So in that case uh, initially you have to sort and then you have to apply this unique. So this is the reason I thought uh, in this episode let me cover uh, you know, both these commands. Sometimes you may use uh, uh, together uh, these uh, commands and sometimes with just uh, sort alone you can manage and in case if it is jumbled uh, assume you have uh, the entry like you know 55 and then 22 something like that you can just do is uh, you know you can just uh, do a sort and then you can uh, just do unique after that or else with just a sort alone you can just do sort hyphen minus u so this will give you you know unique entries of this 
example as well. So let me just uh, take you guys uh, to my desktop uh, and let me just uh, show you some couple of instances and example in real time scenario where you can use it. So guys uh, welcome to my uh, desktop guys. Uh, what I have done is I just uh, created this uh, test file called as mydb.txt. You can assume almost like this can be a kind of CSV file or some sort of command output of some log messages or anything as that. So now what you can do is uh, using uh, you know cut command you can filter uh, whichever uh, columns you want. We can just uh, take as an example we can just filter the names. So you can just do cut minus F. It's the second field and uh, this is uh, delimited by, by space. You, know, you can just do this. As you can see here it filters uh, the second column. So now you can do is uh, you can uh, just do a sort. So it can uh, sort this in alphabetical order as you can see here. And now what you can do is you can do something with their age field which is like you no know, third field. We can assume it is their age of the employees or something like that. And uh, now we are getting uh, the age alone and again we can apply you no know, sort option. And as you can see here it has this uh, duplicate entry and in this case you can use uh, sort minus u to filter out and uh, display only unique entries and uh, same thing you can do even with the combination of unique but in case if you use unique alone it is not going to uh, produce the desired output the reason is uh, unique needs uh, sub subsequent entries uh, you know uh, to be the same and then it filters out as well. so that is the reason before doing the unique you need to do a sort and then you can pipe it to unique so now it shows the unique entries as well. so so this is just a simple example and my real uh, career uh, i have done uh, filtering uh, with respect to millions of rows as well. so you know whenever you do such uh, such a thing you have to bear in mind uh, to do some sort of load sharing and uh, things like that and uh, you know and the more you do uh, kind of load sharing in your processing servers it is going to finish this work faster and in case really if you have million rows you can see some noticeable uh, time delays and uh, stuff like that in terms of processing the entire uh, data assets so so this is one way you can do or otherwise you can use uh, sort minus u generally if you see the man page of unique you can uh, uh, quite understand the scenario of unique assets so as you can see here it is meant for filtering adjacent matching lines from any input so that's what is unique meant for and uh, so that is the kind of uh, limitation with unique so you can use sort and unique together whenever a situation occurs there are also various uh, options which are existing for sort you can see over in man pages but the idea of my videos is in terms of making you understand some sort of real time uh, you know scenarios i can even show you some couple of examples something like say if config if you do we can take something like this entry where in which it has uh, it has been displaying the total collisions happened and uh, transmit queue length or something like that so we can just uh, filter with a grep command with this option collisions so it is showing this entry for three interfaces which are in my system and now what you can do is you can just uh, do is a unique option since you can see here these two are occurring one after another so this way what happens is uh, it filters out duplicate entries or if you want to doubly make sure that you are really filtering out you can just use a sort and then you you can use the unique option as well. so so that's all guys so this is how you can use a sort and unique commands i hope you guys liked watching this video please do subscribe to this channel guys so thank you have a nice day